all right guys here you can see this is a gold and a daily chart so first i will analyze who people are positional trader positional trader so uh, they can use breakout trading strategy here so you can see gold are running in a sideways right now right here we have seen a range right now gold is running in this range so price is running in a sideway and they are respecting moving average 50 and a red one so this is a 50 exponential moving average right but price is running in a side uh, sideway we have seen this is the range of our gold range and running in this range so how we will use breakout trading strategy so in that case we have to find out uh, three swing point we have seen this is the first swing point price is rejecting from this area second swing point we have seen price rejecting from this area third we have seen this is rejecting from this area so if you want to see previous market behavior price are rejecting from this area and the support are there so in that case i want to draw a horizontal resistance line right so this is called a resistance line so we have seen there was multiple rejection in this area so rejection number one two three four five and this line around three eight this line just a minute three eight uh five nine four uh these line are respecting both sides first we have seen they are re respecting as a resistance line reverse back so here we have seen rejecting as a support and here we can see rejecting from this multiple rejection are there from this area so how we will use breakout trading strategy so in breakout trading strategy we are looking for right uh, this is for uh, positional trader so i'll discuss in intraday trader how to trade now we are looking for a candle open and close above this resistance line around 38594 right once they appear that type of candle which is open and close above this resistance we are looking for buy above that candle right so we have seen price is running right now and let me draw the supporting line so intraday trader I just connected most touches point here so have you seen most touches point I just connected most swing low point right here we have seen price rejecting from this area right most rejecting point most recent rejecting point that means price is running in this range right now and this is called sideway market right and the positional trader above we are looking for buy right so let's check it in a small time frame like uh, four hour how it should look like that in a four hour we have seen and uh, the price is running near this resistance line right here we have seen and a four hour we can use uh, like a breakout trading strategy price close above and uh, open and close are above uh, above uh, this resistance line so we are looking for buy above this area right and remember one thing uh, price are not able to create previous uh, not able to break this previous higher point right here we have seen that was the higher point price are rejecting from that area right so if price reverse back toward this supporting line around 37833 so we are looking for buy right and then similarly if any bearish candlestick pattern are forming in below this resistance line we are looking for sell right here in this area remember once break we will buy right so let's check it in a small time frame like uh, 15 minute how it should look like and 15 minute you can see here right and the 15 minute uh, for the intraday trader uh, people also uh, they can also use breakout trading strategy so before if you wanna you uh, trade by using breakout trading strategy so we have to find out most recent higher point right swing point so let me show you here 
we have seen first higher point and after that we have seen another lower high lower high and a lower high let me draw a diagonal turn line by using previous higher point so exactly i drawn by connecting previous higher point right so now you can see uh, price are rejecting from this area and now becoming a resistance line right when i connected this swing point right here right we have seen four touches point are there so if you want to trade by using breakout trading strategy so in a 15 minute chart we are looking for a candle whose open and close are above this area so before we start buying or uh, before we start uh, using this strategy we have to uh, find out that criteria uh, what are the criteria uh, when we are going to use breakout trading strategy first criteria one uh, sorry 50 moving average should be above 150 moving average so here we have seen this is 150 exponential moving average this one and this is 50 now we have to focus on is 50 moving average are above in this uh, 150 moving average yes so here you can see this is a 50 and 150 so criteria number one and the next we are looking for breakout right minus a 50 percentage r so 45 uh, sorry 45 days period i am using just a minute so we are looking for 45 here you can see percentage are 45 are right now running uh, exactly near minus 50 level so we are looking for breakout if price break this minus 50 level and at that time we are looking for a breakout candle right so we have seen all criteria are uh, of uh, what criteria we are looking for for breakout trading strategy all are fulfilling here so that is why we are looking for a breakout candlestick right so let me show you another here you can see the price is just trying to break out but still they are not able to break this level so most of the people are entering here that is the wrong entry this is not called high probability yet it is a probability to reverse back toward this area so no need to take buy right now right we are looking for so most of the people are thinking here price is creating lower low lower high lower low lower high lower low lower high and right now people are looking for sell and in this area yeah but you can enter here for the sell but it is very risky so that means if you want to enter for the sell in this area that means you are going against the trend trend is running in an uptrend now price is giving this one call a retracement so it is very risky so that is why you just wait to break the level of this so let me show you for the sell entry we are looking for at least the break this previous lower point right here we have seen this is a lower point lower point lower point, right so most of the people are thinking here almost 200 point how can i miss this 200 point right that is the most important point and most of the people are doing big mistake and i always tell you that uh, don't try to catch every point because in this zone we never knows in which direction price will go right if they break this level so this is a probability to touch this previous higher point right or if they break this lower point it is a probab uh, there is a probability to reverse back toward this previous lower point so that is why we have seen this is our sell entry this is our buy entry now most of the who people are following the trend like that it's okay but this is a risky right that is why we never enter we're looking for a high probability trade only right where we can minimize our loss 
So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. And uh, thanks for watching.